Welcome back to Crypto Studio 247. My name is Ty, and in this video today, I will be walking you through CoinMarketCap.com. This is one of the most requested tutorials that have been asked from the community, and so we've created this video today to walk you through exactly how we navigate crypto uh, coinmarketcap.com and how you can do the same. So if you're brand new to this channel, please subscribe to our channel. Please hit the like button. Take a look at some of our other content. Uh, we provide you with news, analysis, and cryptocurrency updates every single day. If you're not following us on Twitter, give us a follow on Twitter, on our Twitter account. This is an account that we're actively growing. Give us a follow on Twitter. We would appreciate the follow and the support. I want to remind everyone that this video, of course, is not financial advice. And of course, all of the information provided on our videos, they are for opinion and educational purposes only. Please do your own due diligence. Now, CoinMarketCap is one of the tools that we use as cryptocurrency investors and traders. And the purpose of this site is to provide you with real-time price feed data. And that allows you to make buying decisions, do due diligence, and provides you with unique specific information to the various coins that are available and that can be traded on different exchanges whether they're centralized exchanges or decentralized exchanges as you can see the current price of bitcoin it is twenty thousand dollars eight hundred and fifty five dollars and ninety two cents the current circulating supply of bitcoin is 19 million btc it's got a max supply of 21 million btc with ethereum you can see that the current price is one thousand two hundred and five dollars and eighty eight cents and there's currently a hundred and twenty one million eth that are currently in circulation what else this page tells us is that there's a total of 513 different exchanges. The current market capitalization is $939 billion. And the dominance for BTC, it is 42.3%. And for ETH, it's 15.6%. I'm going to explain what this is shortly and why it's relevant. There are currently 20,000 different crypto coins tokens that are available to be bought and to be sold um, for those of you who have been around the markets for a very long time you know that a lot of these coins uh, are junk they're not going to make it they're not going to go far however um, the important coins of course are included in that total as well what i mean by important are the coins that are going to be here we can confidently say uh, for a very long time this list, this page here represents the top 100 coins. As you can see, there's a variety of different uh, coins available. That of course being Bitcoin, Ethereum, USDT stablecoin, USDC stablecoin, the Binance coin, Binance USD coin, XRP, Cardano, Solana, Dogecoin, Polkadot. This page here, page number one, gives you a total of approximately 100 different tokens and as you can see from page to page to page you can click down and see a variety of different tokens that are currently trading and this current order is based on market capitalization so how do we determine market capitalization well the way that's done is by taking the current price of the token multiplying it by the circulating supply and that's how we get the market cap when we take the price of the token and we multiply it by the max supply 
that will give us our fully diluted market cap and that's of course based on the current price of twenty thousand eight hundred twenty four dollars and forty three cents the volume this is based on 24 hours and you can see here as well this is the increase in volume that we've seen over the last 24 hours the specs on this page give you details about the website for the token gives you also information about um, social media so when you click over here on community on a variety of tokens in many cases you'll get access to their reddit you'll get access to the twitter account so let me show you with a different token you can see that by taking a look at a coin for example like bnb if i choose bnb and i go back to community it will lead me directly to the twitter account for binance coin okay let's back out to that list one more time we were looking specifically at bitcoin and we were looking at the market cap the fully diluted market cap here you can see the overall market chart this is broken down by one day seven day one month three month one year year to date and all time so year to date of course represents from the beginning of january 2022 up until today's date one year would represent the last 365 days of course last three the three month represents the last three months and this is what you're going to simply get here when you are choosing these different um, graphs that you can look at in terms of timelines market cap shows you the same sort of information lets you know for the last three months where the market cap of bitcoin has been and this is a great tool this is a tool that will give you a lot of information about where the token is and it will also give you a lot of information about pricing and so on and so forth so very valuable information can be found here um, on coin market cap specifically when we start to dive into each of these individual tokens now I mentioned earlier about the market capitalization when you click market cap here just like the individual tokens we can break down the last one day seven day one month three month and this will tell us exactly where the total market capitalization has been the bottom graph represents the volume in addition to the market cap we can look specifically at dominance now what this number represents in terms of dominance is what percentage of the entire market cap is in Bitcoin and what percentage of the entire market cap is in Ethereum so when you hear people talk about Bitcoin dominance this represents that 42 42.3 percent of the entire market cap value is in Bitcoin and 15.6 percent of the entire market cap value is in ETH this is what we are finding with the market caps for these two particular coins and this is what the dominance represents 47 GUE is the current price for gas gas uh, for ethereum now let's look at the next piece of valuable information this this website has got a lot of great tools um, it's got a lot of great indicators one of the things that we like a lot is this trending tab lets you know what coins are currently trending and this is based on searches done on coinmarketcap.com lets you know what's being trending what people are looking into so it's another great place to play if you're looking to do some due diligence based on what people are looking at what people are searching check out that tab it's very useful information in addition to the trending tab you'll get the most recently added most recently added lets you know the tokens and coins that have recently been added to coin market cap lets you know that's how long ago it was added again the same sort of information the price last hour 24 hours fully diluted market cap volume 
and this is an indicator of what blockchain uh, that coin is um, a part of and what, what coin that's being developed on. So you can see here lots of Binance coin, Polygon, um, Solana. That's what you can see here by taking a look at the new cryptocurrencies. Backing out again, you will have some information here about ranking, recently added, category, spotlight. This is just different points of data that you can use when you're doing due diligence. Gainers and losers is a section uh, that we like quite a bit uh, on coinmarketcap.com and we'll let you know what the top gainers are based on their criteria. So you can see here you have to have a minimum of $50,000 in trading for the last 24 hours to make it to this list. And the same thing for the losers. They let you know the biggest losers as well. Same criteria. Um, can also be found here as well. So again, this is another area where we like to do some due diligence, see what's hot, see what's pumping. And it's a great starting place when you're starting to do a little bit of research into these different tokens. So you know exactly what kind of options are available to you. Here's an example of a token. It's got $60,000 in volume. So in my opinion, the volume is quite low. However, in the last 24 hours, it's up 900%. You can see here this coin, Cashera. This is the price. It's up 171% in the last 24 hours. So it's got $77,000 in trading volume in the last 24 hours. So you never want this to be the exact reason why you're going to be buying a token. However, we have found that this kind of information can be very useful into at least adding coins to a watch list, or it can be very useful in your, your simple due diligence process. Um, what we sometimes see people doing is coming here, going to the biggest loser, and you know deciding to buy this coin, for example, because it's down 55%, with the assumption that tomorrow it's gonna turn around. We don't suggest that you do this. Um, that I believe is a recipe for disaster. So we, we, we highly recommend not to do that. Again, this is just another data point that you should be using um, when it comes to doing due diligence before you decide to make any sort of buying or investing decision. Okay, let's back out of this. One thing I did mention was a watch list. So by clicking watch list, you can see that there are uh, the capabilities to create a watch list. And the cool thing about a watch list is that you can make it uh, private or you can make it public. And if I make a public watch list, then the coins that I add to this watch list, when I share a specific public link to you know my friends, my community, they can see exactly what it is um, that we're keeping our eye on. And so this will allow you to build a list of coins that you wanna watch this will allow you to build a list of coins um, that you are going to be purchasing and you can create a portfolio um, with this as well. So it's another great tool uh, that we like quite a bit. Um, one more thing that, one of the things that we've noticed with CoinMarketCap that they've begun to introduce is this Learn tab. And this Learn tab by CoinMarketCap um, essentially what it does is that it gives you some information about different type of coins um, that are available and different so information that, that can be provided as well. So we like this Learn tab. It's a great place to find out um, you know, terms that are commonly used, updates that are happening inside of the overall market. Uh, we have found that this has been a great resource as well so let's go back to the front page one thing you want to avoid in our opinion is that you know a lot of times there can be things that are promoted on coin market cap and obviously they've got to you know earn revenue to be able to support this website and so they'll you know from time to time you'll see different tokens that uh, they're going to be spotlighting um, we don't suggest that you take that as a uh, point of reference for any kind of coin that you want to buy. 
um, but you know people pay for this this is this is a lot of paid advertising um, so do keep that in mind you can see here it says join the owl dial token airdrop if I choose that option there will be some things uh, that I can do to be able to earn this airdrop you can see here how to participate what that is required to participate and this is an active airdrop that you can participate in here's the time that's remaining for that airdrop so uh, this is another area that is very beneficial to people that are using coinmarketcap.com okay so we just wanted to share with you guys a very quick review of some of the features and benefits that we see with this website you know we do spend quite a bit of time here on page number one but from our experience what we have found is that a lot of the gems a lot of the nuggets are found further down on coinmarketcap.com so you know again as you go from page to page you'll see that this market cap will be decreasing in size these tokens are a lot more smaller they're a lot more riskier but this is where the gems are found um, guys if you like this kind of content uh, and you do like this video please give it a thumbs up please subscribe to our channel we appreciate you spending this time with us and we hope that this will be a resource that you can use on your cryptocurrency journey and we look forward to providing you with a new video tomorrow have a great evening friends take care leave a comment below about if there's anything that you like about coin market cap or if there's different tools that you're using leave a comment below like this video subscribe to our channel and we will see you tomorrow friends take care